Hello YouTube, in this video I will walk you through the changes happened with the latest Oxygen OS open beta for the OnePlus 3 and 3T. This is open beta 28 for OnePlus 3 and open beta 19 for OnePlus 3T. So this is the change log. We'll go ahead and check out all the basic features. First of all, if you go to settings menu, about phone you can find this version is open beta 18 on my OnePlus 3 and which is based on Android version 8.0.0 with Android security patch level November 2017. So let's go ahead and check out the features. First one is the launcher run. They have optimized the and enhanced the application shortcut menu as well as they have optimized the shelf visual style. So for the first part, if you use this touch and hold option to get extra features here, you can directly go ahead and then click on these shortcuts and then drag it and drop it anywhere you want and then open it and you will be directly going to that particular function so for example i've created an incognito direct shortcut for the google chrome as well as you can do the same thing with any of the apps which supports this for example if i want to go to the search bar so i'll create a search shortcut here and i'll go to directly to the search option so which is really good that you can do the same with any of these functions so for example, let's take a case of uh, play music that I I want to jump directly to the my library app and click I can create a shortcut here. So when I open that, it will directly go to the my library. So this is a really good function. And the next one is the gallery added a photo map to view photos by locations. This improvement came with the Oxygen OS of 5.0. So you'll be able to see these three, three sections one is the photos where you can see all the photos taken by the camera and then here is the collection and then here is the places which will show you a map of from where did you take that photo and then they have also uh, enhanced some ui parts of the gallery which is uh, comes in the contact section where they have added the emergency information to your personal information in the contacts so if you go to contacts here you can see you set up my profile i didn't set up my profile click here you'll be able to see my card so you can create my card and then provide all you your own personal information and here you can find this emergency option here you can also create this emergency information like the name address blood type allergies medic medications organ donor medical notes and everything you can add these things and you can also add the emergency contacts and then in the section systems section we have they have um wireless hotspot management optimizations they have done and then support for aptx and aptx HD. so if you go to settings menu and then turn on the developer options the developer options go down you'll be able to see this bluetooth codec audio codec and you can see all the supported codecs here they have supported all the major codecs which is pretty good and then they did the, some UI fixes for quick settings and then optimized the Wi-Fi performance and security, optimized the battery usage statistics, updated Android security patch level to November, and then other bug fixes and optimizations they have done. So these are the changes they have uh, done for this Open Beta 28 or 9 for the OnePlus 3T. If you are going and checking the Benchmarking score. This is the benchmarking score I've got for this build, which is compared to the uh, Oxynoise 5.0. This is the 5.0 build benchmark, and this is the Geek benchmarking score for this version, which is uh, really high compared to the Oxynoise 5.0 build. So overall, this is a great improvement over the last version of open beta that is that was 27 and i highly recommend you guys to update to this version and i hope you enjoyed this video if so please let me know your thoughts in the comment section below as watching please subscribe for more